Hey y'all! Welcome back to Simply Now. Simply Now. Anyways, I can't dance. Um, <clears throat> by the title, you know that today is a story time. Yay! Gotta love giving the stories. Oh, this guy, this guy, where do I start? It's a question because it's just so funny to me. Um, it's just actually so funny to me. Just how this day went about, I was like, this is why you follow your gut. I feel like I have so many stories where it's like, I knew I shouldn't have been doing, like I knew it wasn't really something, like my gut's telling me don't do it, and I still do it, okay? So we're gonna backpedal. Now, I think this was like, I wanna say two, three years ago, maybe three years ago, who knows? Who the fuck you um, This dude, um, honestly, when I was in high school, like younger, like maybe grade nine or something, I don't know. I was like really new to the area of Milton, and I don't know how the f I ended up talking to this dude, but I ended up talking to him. He ended up siding probably in my, I don't know, Blackberry Messenger. I don't know what the fuck it was. Anyways, but he, I know that I went out with him like one time, and I just remember that it wasn't a good time, but I couldn't remember why because he's like, he's a very generically good looking like he's generically good looking like good body dark skin dreads good looking okay no, i'm kidding <laughs> but generically good looking like if i was to show my picture to someone they'd probably be like oh he's cute like you know but i just i knew in my heart my good like it wasn't the dude for me like that's, but i don't remember why like i really couldn't remember because it was so long ago that like high school and uh, yeah he popped up again and he's been asking, like at that time he was asking, asking to chill, like asking to go on a date, blah, 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 blah. And I wasn't really feeling it, just cause I, I was like, my gut is telling me not to go on a date with this dude. This dude, I can't remember why I didn't fuck with him, but I didn't fuck with him. And obviously by the title, you could tell why I didn't fuck with him. So now that day he was asking to chill and I can't remember why I chilled, but I ended up chilling with him, sadly. And he lived like down the street from me. So it was like, I think, I think I walked or I drove. Either I drove, maybe I drove, it doesn't matter, whatever, fuck it. It doesn't matter. I was at his plate. I was at his house. We were outside chilling. He was doing some <laughs> juggling and shit like that he does likes to do because he's due the most. Um, so he was doing that and I was like, we we're just chilling, chatting, chatting. At that time, he wasn't really annoying me, but he was starting to aggravate me in, in a way that like is very hard to like, if you don't like someone, they just aggravate you in little ways. And yeah, he started to annoy the shit out of me, but um, I was like, no, 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 we're just chilling. I think he offered to smoke and that was where he got me probably gotcha bitch because i was ready to go home <laughs> and then i think he was talking about smoking i was like okay no, no, no. he's like i'm gonna go chill like you want to come to my friends like they're down the street da, da, da. another like don't do this so don't chill with other people when you don't even know the person that well it's just not a good idea again this is like rule number one like like you just don't do shit like that and i should have known like i was old enough to know like this is probably not gonna be great so chill the way he went to his friend's house um they were cool they were like they were just so cute her baby like they were just so cute um they were nice people and her friend was nice and her boyfriend was nice the they had dogs, I love dogs. So like it was just cool. And then um he said some he said some fucked up shit and I was like I can't remember what he said. He said something about his friend's girlfriend, like just inappropriate and it's like why are you talking like you know so that was a turn off I was kind of ready to go we were talking about getting alcohol or something and so we had to go to LCBO regardless whatever so we go to LCBO mind you <laughs> mind you I did not drive to his friend's house so I literally he drove me to his friend's house no license I don't think he was driving illegally <laughs> and when he went to his friends it's like it's like you don't have to really go on the main road you just go on the back road because we live near each other when he said like oh i'll drive he didn't say 
I didn't have a license and all that shit. Mind you, he's driving. His tents are there. Like, his tents are crazy. And he drives thick, so, like, it's making noise. And then you got all the music, like, 6 9 What was it? 6 9 6 9 69? Whatever. He has, he's blasting his music. Nigga this, nigga this, nigga this. I'm like, help me. Help me. Like, oh, my God, Lord. This is not for me. <laughs> this is not for me. Lord knows <laughs> if you know me personally, you know that's not my shit. Okay, I'm going to the LCBO, our local LCBO. Music's blasting, we park. I'm embarrassed because he was not it. Anyways, went to LCBO and he's driving me nuts because he's doing this thing where you know you're in a fucking public place and you should not be juggling so he's juggling his things and it's like sticks so why would you do that in lcpo of course something's gonna fucking fly like something's gonna happen so we're chilling chilling the lady tells him to um put the thing down he doesn't do it he waits until like she's done and then he does it when we're in the line like we go in the lineup and i it's like two minutes after he should probably said it or something i don't know it wasn't that long after she said it he was just he was started bitching like we're in the line and he's doing it and i'm like just relax like obviously she's not feeling you like just relax he was he was not trying to hear me <laughs> So the lady says it again and then and then he starts getting irritated and then he starts bitching and cussing he just started getting very ignorant for no reason like literally well the lady told him to like put your thing down but like she didn't say it in a rude way the first time second time of course you're gonna come with a little bit more bass in your tone because people can't listen when you're a woman I swear anyway it's in the line and we're talking talking and goes to cuss and mind you i think i was the one that was buying liquor like he didn't even i don't think he had his id on him or whatever either way it was me that was doing the fucking purchasing and if i'm doing the purchasing why are you talking why are you chatting shut the fuck up go outside figure it out just get the fuck away period 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 well, he's bitching bitching in line he's making a scene i don't like scene i don't like attention i really don't i really don't i hate i think it's just the most disgusting thing to like try to get attention from people just because you're being rude and ignorant um so he's like oh do you hear this bitch da -da 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 -da. he's calling her a bitch he calls her calls her a bitch out her name so many times i'm like i look at him i'm like could you relax like there's no reason for this just relax you're starting to embarrass me relax like i swear i had to tell him like twice just relax like all that bitching and all that shit is not necessary he starts yelling at the woman and she, i forgot i think he someone else was serving him and she's like i don't have to serve you you know like literally and, da -da -da -da. and then he like walked away and started talking to another like employee literally my face was going so red i was like so embarrassed because um as i'm cashing out he's just like that bitch that fucking bitch over there fucking bitch like every fucking word like just just disgusting and i couldn't believe that i was literally like everyone was looking at me like and i know what they were thinking bruh because when someone's being ignorant and someone's with them, I'm like, why the fuck is she with him? And all I can think in my head, this is not my nigga, this is not my dude, this is not my dude, don't even, don't even think about it, this is not my dude. Like, it's just so embarrassing, it's like secondhand embarrassment when you're with someone and they're just acting a fool and you're like, shit, like, fuck, uh, especially if it's a dude and you're not fucking uh, that dude. I know everyone is looking at me like sideways. And then we're going in the car and we're going in the car and he's cussing, cussing, cussing. Like literally at that point he was going to get kicked out. He was going to get security called on him. I'm just like, let's go. And the funny part is like I went back to the LCBO and I seen her and I'm like, and it was a while after, I think like a month after. And I was like, I'm really sorry. Da -da -da, my friend like da -da -da -da. and she's like, child, I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. I was like, oh, okay, never mind that, never mind. But she's like, I appreciate you for saying sorry. If that did happen, like, it takes a lot of, you know, it's because it, it's just, like, disgusting. At that point, I was just like, oh, my God. Ooh, Lord was really trying to tell me, like, 
there's a reason why this dude like it was it wasn't even like a thought in your head at any time in life literally i had to think to myself like did we even talk like beforehand like probably we probably talked like a little but um, that first time we met up probably turned me the fuck off to, like really just ignore the fact that i met him and you know the funny thing is when we got back to his friend's house his friend's girlfriend was like I, um I'm like, are you dating him or whatever? I'm like, are you dumb? Do you think I would date him? And she's like, oh girl, I have this like, who the fuck can put up with him? I'm like, I thought the same blood clotting. Like, like, I don't know who the hell is putting up with that because it could never be me. And that's the thing, like, oh god, this is why people should date and hide. Like, just date and hide. Wait a minute, wait, wait a minute. Hold, wait, first of all, you're not gonna speed past that like you didn't just say what you just said. Honestly, if anyone I knew or my friends seen me with dude, they'd probably be like, what to know? Why? Because, like, mm -mm, it's just not it. It's not even his looks, his personality is just so disgusting. Why are you, as a man, calling another female a bitch? Like, it just makes you look like a bitch because you can't articulate how you're feeling honestly that was like one of the worst situations i could put myself in just to be in a public place and someone really like verbally assault someone i was so frozen where it's like i just didn't even know how to like get my point across like you're fucked up it was one of those moments where i freezed if i could have just cussed him out at that moment like after that i don't think i talked to him like i don't think so I don't know. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine. That is one of my stories. Okay. Boys. Okay. Ladies, comment down below and let me know if you've had a bad date. I think that was my worst date. I've had really bad dates, mind you. I've been on a lot of dates because, you know, sing. Anyways, that was the worst. That was the biggest waste of my time. A lesson, just stay in your lane. Date who you actually like. Don't give these niggas a chance. Chances are for squares, honestly, fuck that. Thank you so much for joining this chit chat story time. Please tune in on the next video by subscribing down below and hitting that post notification bell so you get all my notifications on when I post. And don't forget to like. Thank you guys. Bye. Peace. I'm not trying to hear me. Ew, ew. So yeah, take it back. I'll tell you the shit you put yourself through. He was, what was he doing? Oh my God, that was the worst fucking day of my life.